Hawks in the red zone for the first time today. Gavalis fakes the give to Heyman, keeps it running left. Now going to burst out the middle. He fires through into the end zone for the touchdown. Yanni Gavalis on the 16-yard keeper takes it in. Handing the shot out of the shotgun. Going to throw a quick bubble screen to Jones. Dropped Ooh. immediately in the backfield. Ooh. Sean Callahan comes up and makes the four-yard blast. Well, that's how you pop somebody right there. That contagious as well. The entire sideline feeling that one. Forcing the punt. Well, now Mulligan with his second punt of the day. Pace puts the rush on high. Spiraling kick. Devere calls for the fair catch. Oh. Hits a pace player in the back. Live ball. St. Ace has it. It's Richie Curran picking it up and carrying it down inside the 10. You can't advance it, though, but either way, it's St. Ace football. Beautifully done. Special teams who had a big hit earlier on the kickoff. And heavy set on third and goal. Gavalis gives to Heyman trying to sprint around the right side. He turns the corner, and he's in for the touchdown. Well, Only man had a shot at him, Chukwameka and Joku Obi, and Heyman with those quick feet able to turn the corner for the one-yard touchdown run. Hawks are going to go for two after the extra point was blocked after the Gavalis touchdown run in the first quarter. Interesting. Try to make it a 14-0 game. Hill in motion. Gavalis takes the snap, looking to throw, looking for Hill, and he's got him. Two-point conversion converted. As Hill was able to hang on, thrown to the turf by Jasheem Banks. Good. Third down and two. Hawks have to get it across midfield here. Gavalis with the keeper, going to turn the corner. He's across the 49, down to the 40, the 35, 30. Pushed out of bounds and took an extra shoulder. That'll bring a flag in, so tack on half the distance as Gavalis with a big run on third and short. It's going to take the Hawks inside the red zone after the penalty. Hawks are going to go for it here. They're going to line up quickly, see if they can catch pace off guard. Gavalis gets him lined up, tries to lean in on the QB keeper, and the line gets the push. Gavalis takes it in from a half yard out. His second rushing touchdown of the game. Still waiting for the official signal down on the field, but Gavalis yep. with the push definitely got in. And now the Grapponi Stadium crowd erupts in cheers as Yanni Gavalis makes it a 20-0 game with his second rushing touchdown today. Fourth down, 15 seconds left. St. A is going to elect to go for it here. Hawks want a fresh football in the game. This one would be about a 42-43 yarder. Into the wind. Into That's the a wind little bit out rain, of Parisi's yeah. distance. So Hawks will go for it on fourth down. Gavalis has time, now steps up. Going to throw for the end zone, looking for Shosky. Jump ball is caught! The big wideout came down with it. Connor Shosky fought off two setter defenders, and the Hawks strike again just before half. Artak lined up in the slot. He's been the go-to man on this drive. Gavalis gives to King. This time he jumps it in. Corey King in for the score, his second touchdown of the season. Third time's a charm for the junior from California. An island. Third and goal, quick slant, Hill's got it, and a touchdown. And as I say that, Banks gets lit up. The two connect again, Gavalis <laughs> to Kyle Hill, seventh touchdown hookup of the year for those two. And with less than 30 seconds to go in the third quarter, the Hawks strike again. Yeah, Banks and Ferraro talking to each other after that one, a miscommunication. Yeah, I mean, we got the first one under our belt. It was, uh, it was a great feeling. Uh, we certainly haven't practiced like a team that has our record. I mean, that's kudos to our kids and our character and their work ethic. Uh, you know, at times we haven't executed the way we want to or we've been out executed and made mistakes, but that's part of football, and uh, it's uh, part of the process that we continue to change our culture here. Uh, I really thought our offense did a great job, uh, you know, especially when they are going against the wind. Had some really key drives, and guys make some big plays on third and fourth down. And uh, I think I went for it on fourth down a ton today. I just had a ton of uh, 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 belief in our offense. And defensively, uh, you know, we did a good job of stopping the run. They got a couple of pieces in there. but uh, And then we were able to pressure uh, on, some, on some later downs that we got a chance to open up our blitz package and the things that we've been working on. So really a, a team effort today, offense, defense, special teams, and um, – Great execution by our kids as far as understanding the plan and working the plan to be victorious. Yeah, you know, for Yanni, uh, it was uh, really putting a plan together and take take what the defense gives us, you know, and uh, 
Um, if they're going to pressure, we're going to get the ball out. If they're going to give us a, a, a good box, then uh, we're going to um, you know, run the football. So really, I thought he did a great job of managing the game. I, I give a lot of credit to our coaches as far as sitting down uh, with some of our offensive guys and just going through some of the pieces that uh, we wanted to try and accomplish today. And uh, more importantly, we didn't turn the ball over, which has been our, our challenge here this year. And I uh, really, really stress that to our team about touchdowns and turnovers, and they really took uh, they really took ownership of it. Hey, college football, man, it's hard to win in college football, you know. And and this this ball was was presented to me by Josh Garrett, one of our captains, uh, is priceless. Uh, I think of a lot of things that have gone into this. I think of all of our kids. I think of our starters and our scout team guys. I think of our uh, equipment people and our people behind the scenes that do everything to make uh, our jobs easier. And I really, really appreciate it. And it's onward and upward, onward and upward from here. And um, I'm just excited to be here and, and plant the foundation that we can all be proud of.